These singles stepped into the inferno already burning hot. But which couples kept their flames flying and which couple's steam fizzled out? <laughs> Song Jie and Kim Hyun Joon. The highly sought after bachelorette known for her jaw dropping beauty was hard to get, but ultimately, she chose someone who cares just as much about their appearances as she does, as she chose fashion model and personal trainer Hai Yun Jun to be her man. He nicknamed himself Puppy on the show as he was always eagerly awaiting Jia's presence, and lucky for him, she's an animal lover, as Jia told him, Let's go, puppy, in the final episode. <laughs> As for where the couples on the show stand now, the show's producer Kim Jae Won revealed that Singles Inferno was shot in July 2021. So it's been six months since they left the island, but the producers are unwilling to reveal their relationship statuses and suggest the cast reveal it on their own channels. So whether these couples are still together or not are up for speculation. A hint to this couple still being together was when Hyun Jung had shared an Instagram story featuring a golden retriever on a leash after the finale aired, referring to his puppy nickname. We can assume this means they are still romantically involved or at least on good terms. As for what Jia is up to now, she has her own YouTube channel by the name Frisia. OG Taik and Kang So Yun. It's hard to believe these two attractive and equally successful singles have not been snatched up yet, but it looks like they found a match in each other. During the show, the tailor shop owner was initially very into So Yoon. Only to downplay their connection. But through the turmoil in the Inferno, they managed to get out, seemingly still romantically involved. In August 2021, the two hinted at playing tennis together. An Instagram post shared by So Yun showcased her playing tennis, and it was liked by Jin Tech. Meanwhile, around the same time, Jin Tech also posted an Instagram video of him of what looks like to be the exact same tennis court. Plus, on her YouTube channel, So Yun took a trip to Jeju Island, where in the background there looks to be a faint silhouette of what fans believe to be Jin Tech. Meanwhile, Jin Tech had posted a photo with the tagged location being on the same island as well. Not only do these two hang out at the same spots, but they also follow each other's friends and family members. It seems they're not only dating, but maybe getting serious. Moon Sehun and Shin ji -yeon. If at first you don't succeed, you try, try, and try again. This was the model restaurant owner Si Hoon followed when he was indirectly turned down several times by the woman he chased hard after, Ji Yoon, a neuroscience major. They started getting close during their luxury getaway in the last two episodes, where we see Ji Yoon tearfully opening up to Si Hoon about the emotional journey she's been on. Fans were happy they finally coupled up towards the end, but are they still together? We're not quite sure. They follow each other on social media, but there's no hint as to if they are romantically involved. But Ji Yoon's social media account is quite new since she was previously hacked, so we'll just have to wait and see. As for Si Hoon, he's been quite busy operating his restaurant and even had co stars Kim Jun Sik and Cha Hyun Sung visit him. Kim Jun Sik and Anya Won. While Ye Won pretended to reject Jun Sik at the finale, oh, oh. Oh, the two ended up leaving the island as a couple. This is a reflection of just one of the many ways they have been witty and unproblematic with each other, which won the hearts of viewers. While the relationship status remains unclear, he did hint at perhaps there still being a romance when Jun Sik reposted a collage of himself and Ye Won on his Instagram. Aw, cute. The two follow each other on social media, so they probably are still on good terms. He's currently a health product brand owner while she's a personal trainer, Pilates instructor, and a model. An Ye Won and Cha Hyun Sung. While Hyun Sung said he had second thoughts about not choosing Ye Won in the show's finale, it seems the two are on good terms as they released a YouTube video reviewing their reality show. Cha explained, I even told the other guys, I told everyone that Ye Won is very charming. And I was at the point where I had to decide. I was going to talk to you more after I came back, but as soon as I got back, your response was, you must have had fun, huh? He admits that he did regret it now, but it's good to see the two hanging out as friends. 
It looks like many of the couples have remained on good terms. We'll just have to keep up with their social media to see what they're up to next. Who is your favorite Singles Inferno couple? Let us know in the comments below. Like this video if you want to stay up to date on the latest reality TV news, and we'll see you next time on Things Reality.